what is up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's Zig and Bagel here, and welcome to World of Warcraft Classic. Alright, so, I totally forgot last week that we were going to be doing some WoW Classic for this week, so uh, let's just go ahead and jump right in, we're doing Ladius the Hunter. Uh, I only have skipped the intro, I haven't done anything else with him yet, so let's get going. So, uh, I have been playing on and off throughout the week on my main character, getting things leveled up, and it's definitely been a lot of fun. I will say that once you get past level 10 and move on to the other area, it does become a giant pain in the butt. <laughs> it takes a really long time to progress from there. Uh, let's just get our stuff organized here real quick-like, so everything is good to go. Switch to that one so all the bars are correct. Uh, make sure that, nope, not that, that our interface is here and we have all the right stuff. Auto loot's going on. Action bars. Uh, okay, sure, yeah, we'll uh, do that and it should be good for now. Um, hmm, it's not showing all the info. Let's see, move these out of the way a touch, and let's see, uh, progress, yeah, that should be there, show empty buttons, there we go, I like to have that on, and there we are, so here we are, Laddie's the Explorer, in the, where are we, Valley of Trials, I think we did a little bit of this the last time we came on during the, uh, the test phase for Classic, but now I have mods on so we can actually see what's going on. And uh, the one here for helping with questing is called Questy, which is definitely a lot of help. I have a few others that are on as well. But look at that. Actually be able to see what we're doing. It's definitely helpful. So we have our bow ready. Yes. Okay, here we go. And one down, nine more to go. So very fun. So yeah, I'd love to hear what you guys are playing, where you're at, and how much fun you've been having with WoW Classic. It's definitely uh, been interesting, to say the least. There we are. Here, I'll probably, let's see, rearrange this a touch, like so. Good, good, good. So just a few more, and we will have more done. Let's see, what are all these? That's all the boar. This is more quest to pick up. Just seeing if there's anything else in the area we can do. Try to get them at the maximum range so we get more shots in this guy. Oh, yeah. Because then, it doesn't take too many hits of actually whacking him with our axe. Come on, one more. Yay! Let's back up a touch. There we go. What? I missed. All right. Good, good, good. So yeah, I'd love to hear what your plans are for the week. Any fun things that have happened this week. And just overall how you're doing. Let's see, how far is this guy? Alright, get him in range and... Yes. Enjoy my arrows to the face. See, look at that. Only had to hit him once. Come on. There we go. Now we're right at the edge of the range. And yay, we leveled up to level two. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to do uh, skinning and leather working for professions on this guy. Just because it works good for a hunter considering you wear leather. 
and skinning is one of those really good professions that uh, it's basically all profit because most things that you kill you can skin and it's uh, it's free money Let's see two more and then we're good to go Yes, I know that spell's not ready yet. Sometimes I just spam buttons. Do 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 do. All right, and let's see this guy. Come on. I want it done. And there we go. One quest down. A hundred thousand more to go. So let's see. Quest over here, that one's for level 5. Cutting teeth. Just trying to see what we got going on here. Oh, wait, what's going on? Why isn't it not showing the good map? This is weird. Um, okay. Not sure what's going on. I have been playing on my laptop, so the map looks a little different, and I'm pretty sure I didn't add anything that should have changed that. All I added this morning was Auctioneer, because I found out that they finally have Auctioneer for uh, Classic, so good, good, good. Oh, come on, get out of the way. Is there a Hunter Trainer here? Mage. That's Warrior. Where is the Hunter Trainer? Must be in here? Maybe? Strength and honor. Strength are indeed. Leather cloth. We'll go with the leather guy. Like so. Okay. And get you equipped. And you equipped. Just like that. Okay. Good to go. So what do we have? Oh, it looks like Huh? Oh, he's right here. I was like, what's going on? Oh, Hunter Trainer, there you are. You're hiding behind a post. I seek training. Trek Beast. And we can't afford anything yet. Can I sell? Are any of you? No. Just trying to find somebody who I can actually sell to. There we go. To get enough money to actually learn anything. Zug Zug, that was a that was a really weird thing you said there. Interesting. Okay. Put you here and you here. Do we have we have forty eight? I can't remember how much we needed to learn the track beast. But yeah, that's uh the fun of the WoW classic. Very authentic, not being able to learn your skills very easily. So track beast, yeah okay, ten. So we can. Yay! We'll get rid of unavailable and just show the available ones. <clears throat> Come back over here and learn this guy. Galgar. Okay, Scorpid Working Tail. So we gotta kill scorpions. And whoa, what did this one put on? Cactus Apple. Ah, I remember this from when we did it last time. We just gotta pick these cacti. So fun! Getting cactus. There we go. Oh, come on. Yeah, uh, on my warrior for my main, it's been a lot of, of very interesting in the uh, the crossroads area. Doing all those quests, it just seems like it takes a really, really long time to do stuff, and end up having to just join groups to get some things done because you'll have kill quests where you have to loot something, and the guys seem way over level for what you're doing, and trying to kill one of them can almost kill you. It's a lot of fun. Alright, so 4 out of 10. Up this way should be where some of these scorpids are. Methinks. Oh, looks like somebody else is on that quest right now, too. 
Uh, that's one part of it, too, is there's so many people. When I logged in for the Warrior right away, right when the release happened, there was hundreds of Torrens all stacked on each other in the very starting area, like right where you spawn. It's pretty crazy. And there's been... Um, queues and all that especially at peak times of the day didn't have to worry about one at this time of the day but definitely when you get closer to around like the five o'clock time uh, at least in the u.s then you start to have to uh worry about issues all right let's get one of these scorpions hopefully the drop rate is not too horrible And there we go. Yep, still didn't get one. <laughs> well, we'll we'll figure it out eventually here. We have three more apple guys. Sir Cough. Hello, Scorpid. I want your tail. Please give me your tail. Uh, just the terrain and the scenery. So good. Alright, one down. Nope, seriously? Uh, man, sometimes these drop rates, huh? Have to kill a whole... Look at that, we need ten scorpid tails. We've already killed two guys and got nothing. There we are. Your scorpion here. Let's try to work to the far range. Yes, I know I need to get closer. And bloop. Yes, I know. And yay. Okay, look, we finally got one. I did forget to put damage I'll Just try to put some of our Skills up here. Blood Fury. Increases base melee attack power. Cool. Got that one up here. Let's put our track beasts up. Guess we'll put it in the T slot. I got that on the main for a uh, taunt. Raptor Strike. Make sure we got all of the stuff. And hopefully we'll get another tail from this. Oh, come on. I missed. It, it was perfectly still. He wasn't even a moving target. Ooh, what's that green thing here? Sarkoth Mangled Claw. So I guess I gotta take a guy out this, this direction. And luckily there's nobody else over here, so we got all the scorpions just to ourselves. Okay. Trying to wait, okay, for some of these guys to respawn. Because we just need one more. And we've done it. All the cactus apples. Yeah, and it's even the good old days where you have to have uh, ammo for these. I don't know if it's still that way in retail. It doesn't feel like I've had to buy ammo for my uh, hunters in a while. But definitely something you have to keep up on, making sure that you have the ammo to do the things you need. Don't want to get caught in the middle of a fight without any ammo. Yes, it's still recharging. Luckily, arrows and bullets are not that expensive. They're pretty, pretty cheap for like a stack of 200 of them. Like, I think it's maybe 50 copper, so not really too bad. Alright, come on. What's this? Healing effects reduced. Okay. So we need seven more. Well, at least we're getting all this XP. Not too far away from leveling again. While we're fighting, just check things out. 
Yay, another one. Let's make sure where is this guy? Should be up that way. So we'll head in that direction and try to find the Sarkov guy or yeah, looks like Sarkov. Yay, and we've leveled up. Halfway there to our working tails. Is that the guy? Oh, that's Sokov. That's a big boy. Shouldn't be too bad, though. I hope. Just make sure we're fully healed up. Just in the nick of time. Okay. Come within range. Yes, he walked into range. Ooh, nice. Spiked a 24 hit. Oh, yeah, this will be easy. Already got him down to about a third left before he came even close to us. We've done it. What? Okay. I was going to say, we can't be full yet. Do have to work on getting more bags soon, because that's something that is definitely uh, important. Making sure you got the bag space. Actually, just last night on the main character, I finally got my first gold and immediately basically spent it on upgrading to uh, eight slot bags. <laughs> so, good times. Good times. Just so I could go out and quest more and not have to worry about coming back to sell stuff or put stuff away. Like go back to Thunder Bluff and sell more stuff on the auction house. Okay, let's see. So, four more tails. I don't want to head back out and turn anything in until I finished them all. Because we might as well stay out here. Zoom in a touch. Hello. Yes. Oh, gosh. Sokoth again. Totally forgot about a respawn. Yes, I know that spell's not ready yet. Um, okay, I guess we can kill it again. It's not a big deal. You just didn't get to get good shots into him this time. Oh, come on. Take him out. Yay! Oh, we got a working tail from him. Nice. Let's come over here and hopefully grab this tail and make our way back down so we don't have to worry about that respawn again. Okay, two more tails. And then we're done. Uh, okay, so that's the guy there that we can turn in. I think that's the Sokoth Mangled Claw. Okay, one more tail. Let's come over here and just turn this one in. Make sure there's not going to be anything else that he wants to send us on. The, uh, what? Hanazua. Hanazua, interesting name. I like it. Nice. Go swiftly, laddies. My fate is in your hands. Okay. And he laid right back down. Come on. Just one more kill. I hope. I hope this guy gives us our tail. And? Please? Yes. Okay, good. We got it. We can head back and get these turned in. One thing I definitely suggest when, uh, especially in WoW Classic, since you aren't going to be able to get a mount until level 40 is to make sure you have your keybind set for your auto walk because you will be wanting to engage that a lot.
like I have engaged right now. So I can just sit back, take my hands off the keyboard, and or just take my hand off of the mouse at least and use WASD to make my movement change. And, uh, yeah, definitely, definitely important. Okay. I have it set for one of my extra Ooh. mouse buttons. What do I need? I need those apples that you gave me. Mmm, they look delicious. Oh, we should probably get rid of some of our junk while we're over here. What can I do for you? Sell trash. Very nice. And we should have something new to train. Hopefully we'll be able to afford it all. We'll come turn this guy in real quick. Soft wool vest. Male. I guess we'll go with you. And we've leveled up to level four. Oh, what? Battle Warren Kate, that's our back. We'll go with a back guy. <clears throat> and we got back, so nothing on our back yet. This is ten. And, oh, we don't have a chest yet either. Hmm. Totally forget how little you come with. Look at us. We are looking good. Oh, a little too close. Hello. Oh, yeah. All right, so it looks like we have a quest we can pick up over here, but I want to make sure that we do any training. We have leveled up two levels. Serpent Sting. Let's make sure we get something that will actually do damage first, and then Aspect of the Monkey. Oh, yeah. Stay away from the voodoo. I will try to stay away from the voodoo. <laughs> uh, it's funny what they say. Put you here, and then the auto shots above. Eventually, I'll probably just get rid of the autos, because don't really need him especially when you have these abilities that'll just this one the serpent sting will engage the auto shot all right let's do our track beast oh yeah look at him tracked up there mortal boar ooh foreman's blackjack wake up a targeted sleeping peon section um, where are these peons? Ooh, okay. Peons over here. Yeah, definitely helpful to have a quest tracking app. Because it's a, it's a pain to try to figure out where you need to go otherwise. We wouldn't have no idea where to go. Uh... He's a lazy peon, but he's not sleeping. Dang it. Work, work. Are these a bunch of lazy peons up here? And vile familiars. Okay. Head this direction then, because we know there should be plenty of options here. Uh, here's a sleeping guy. How many of them do we need, though? Five peons awoken. Wake up. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll wake up. Vile familiar. Hello there. Hello there, crazy running around with his hands in the air guy. Ew, you are quite vile. Yep, wake up. At least we have this poison effect now. Which helps do, what, three damage a second? Yeah, oh, four nature damage every three seconds. Yay. So one down, 11 more to go. At least these are just uh, guys slain. It's not um, a matter of having to worry about a loot table. Uh, it's especially fun when you have some of the bosses for quests, because you'll have like 20 people standing there waiting to do the same thing. Luckily, a lot of people have been nice and uh, 
doing it with uh, grouping up. So, definitely been good. Gives you at least, like, four other chances to hopefully hit it before another group does. Alright, and I keep forgetting my bag's on all the time. Ah, that peon's back asleep. Let's come back over here. Wow, we keep getting a bunch of shields from those guys. I want you to wake up. I think I might need to move this around a bit for our bars, just so this guy's not blocking the character. Uh, let's do that real quick. Nope, I don't want to right click, I want to left click. What is this? Okay, there we go. Put you right there. Okay, much better. Now we can see. See, we need two more peons. And almost halfway down with the familiars. But as you can see, there are quite a few people here. Look at that. I shot him right through the rock. Come on. You can do it. Ouch. Halfway there. Is there a peon over here that I need to wake up? Looks like there should be one over here. Hello. Not that kind of orc. You're not that kind of orc. That's... Wow. I can do that. that. Oh, hello. Work, work. I love what these guys are saying. The lazy peons. Work, work. Gotta work. That was a really funny one when I when I clicked on him. He was like, I'm not that kind of orc. It's like, sorry, bad touch then? Much? <laughs> oh, what? I thought I got the hit on him first. Okay, I guess not. Low mana. See that? I wasted mana on that other guy's. Ah. Oh, I don't know. Okay, there we go. Move that thing out of the way. Hey. Yeah, you need to wake up. Okay. And, hello there. Let's take you out. Let's see. Oh, we got all the peons awakened. We just need three more familiars. There's our guy. Okay, and waiting. So yeah, if this is your first time joining me, thank you. And make sure to follow, because I do streams usually on Fridays in the morning. And as well, um, you can come subscribe on YouTube, where I tend to post the streams after. So if you miss anything, you can watch it there. And all of the... Uh, Old videos got over 500 videos up on YouTube, so come check it out for sure. Okay, just this one last guy, and we are good to go. I 
think. Let's see. Alright, that's all gone. Sweet. Let's head back. Back to camp. Turn it all in. Just in time, too, because we're getting pretty full up. Let's see. Cloth, so we can trade out for those pants. That's 4, 21. Don't have anything on our wrist yet, I don't think. Oh, that's mail? Yeah, I can't wear that. Chest. Definitely better. Because it's leather. And... I think that's all we're going to be able to wear for now. Uh, not too many more levels and we should be able to have our hunter's mark, which will definitely help quite a bit. Maybe, just trying to see. Okay, axe, yeah, we definitely want the axe. We're about 700-ish away. Good, good, good. Oh, I wanted to equip this guy. There we go. And let's come over here and sell our junk. Speak, friend. Okay. Is that all of it? No. Let's get rid of you, you, and you. Oh, that's not, that's a quest item. I can't sell you. Wait, how many... Oh, I got 71 shots. I should probably get some more bullets first. At least one more stack of them. Oh, yeah, look at that. It was like 10 copper for a stack of 200, so not bad at all. Just uh, always make sure you have the money for your uh, for your arrows. Alright, run to waypoint complete quest. Okay, so there's nothing else here. We just have to... Yay, we gotta leave the Valley of, of Trials. Let's do it. That was pretty fast, wasn't it? Going for a nice walk. I'm trying to remember how I get rid of the UI in WoW. It's been so long, I don't remember. Definitely something worth looking up here. I might look at it in a sec as soon as we uh, reach this quest giver over here. You know what? This zone reminds me of the human starting area touch. Just from how it has this little walkway here that leads you into the other region before you go to uh, Goldshire. Hey there, guys. What's, what's happening? So, Dire Molten Boar. Who are you? A core. A core. Great name, friend. Rotor. Okay, and is it this direction? Okay, that's not where we want to go. Let's just follow the path. The path of righteousness. So, interface key bindings. How do we remove a uh, or, uh, interface? The quest log, zone map chat pane I'm not seeing where to go hmm camera no huh not sure I was pretty sure there's a way to get rid of your UI so you don't have to just keep staring at it all the time Yeah, I'm really wondering why my map looks different here. Maybe uh, one of the add-ons updated or something. 
and added some kind of map. I didn't really want to change any of the map interface stuff though. What's this guy over here? Oh. This should be over here. Why was that way up there? Wait. What's the waypoint it's clicking at? <gasps> okay. We probably... Looks like we need to head back. I just realized it looks like there's a quest that's in this guy right here. Okay. Nothing like a nice long walk. It's not like we can just uh, fast travel back there with a hearthstone or anything. I don't think. Oh yeah, returns you to the Valley of Trials. So we can just do that. Uh, it'll suck though, because we might just walk back and learn the innkeeper here so we can quick travel back to uh, Razor Hill. Hello, I'm going to try to jump my way up here and talk to you, because why use a door? Yes, yes, yes. Hello there, innkeeper. Hunk of bread. Yeah, we'll go with the bread. Make this in your home. Yay, Razor Hill is now our home. Excellent. Is there... Okay, we're still level 4. Wow, we're really close to leveling up again, though. Miner. Is there... A leatherworking area over here? I hope we're skinning. They might not have it over here. We might have to go up to Orgamire to learn that stuff. Which might be something I just do on my own, but I want to see if it's here. Just for uh, reference, we'll talk to this guy. Professions trainer, skinning. Yep, trainer and Orgrimmire. Alrighty then. Let's see if we can maybe find a fast route back. Probably won't be able to make it over the mountains. Well, let's just go on auto walk and take a nice, uh, long walk. It wasn't too long of a walk. It was maybe a minute or two. Ugh. Man, been tired lately. For sure. Ugh, okay. So, yeah, just trying to look, because I doubt there's a way to get over the hills. Just seeing what's that over there. Nope, that shouldn't be a way over because if we could find a way to climb over, that would be awesome. Seriously? You can't walk over this tiny little bump? There we go. Much better. How am I tracking these quests, though? It's one thing I'm not sure... how to do. Ooh, that's cool. File Familiars... The spells and how much damage they were each doing. It looks like Auto Shot and Raptor Strike was doing the most damage. Interesting. I like it. I actually haven't looked at the uh, damage done meters here while playing before. Because sometimes I'll just lay back and have a drink and watch some TV while I'm on auto walk going a very, very long distance through the, uh, the Barrens. move over a touch so we don't aggro you all right that's that really really heavy thing and yeah I was wondering why we were leaving the starting area before being level five and that's because I missed something by being a dumb yeah there's two somethings here uh, Faz Rill's pick and Burning Blade Medallions. Cool, cool. Alright, come on. Luckily, to get back will be easy. We can just uh, use our Hearthstone and quick travel back. It's kind of why I wanted to do it this way, because we could have quick traveled back to the Valley of Trials, 
but then we would have had to walk all the way back there. This way, I mean, it's not much different, because either way we're walking that distance, but it just feels better, <laughs> I guess. Alright, so, we just gotta head up to that cave. And hopefully there's already other people over here killing all the stuff, so we can just quickly make our way over to the bad guys that we need. That's one of those times where you hope there's a lot of other people so they can take care of some of the work for you. Yeah, there you are. It's amazing how uh, how many people you see in the starting zones like all the time. Because if you noticed on the... Uh, the character screen at the beginning have like seven characters created. Some, I mean, half of them haven't even like opened them up yet to do anything. Just kind of creating them so they're there. Looks like hopefully there's people over here doing stuff. Seriously, my tiny little level four legs can't make it up very good hills, can it? Ugh. Yeah, go ahead, shoot that guy. I'm gonna shoot this guy. Aspect of the monkey. Ah, uh, fell staker, stalker. Not too many guys here, and we can make our way in fairly well. Yeah, level five. We've done it. Uh, why? It's funny watching chat sometimes. Wow, look at that person's name. Gore friend or Gore fiend. Okay. Gore Fiend. Interesting name. It seems like they're talking to themselves a lot. Wow. Nothing like chat. <laughs> it's always an interesting time for sure. So, uh, yeah, if you're just joining me, thank you for joining me. I tend to do streams on Fridays. And... Uh, probably going to be doing WoW for a while just because why not. And uh, I'd love it if you make sure to follow. Also, I would love you to check out on YouTube where I tend to post these streams as well. So if you missed anything, you can come check it out on YouTube later. There's also over 400 other or uh, over 500 other videos up on YouTube as well. So, plenty for your viewing pleasures. So yeah, I'd love to hear what you're playing in WoW. If you are or you're not, or if you're seeming interested to actually play it now that you've watched this. I would love to hear about it, or just tell me about your week and what you have planned for this weekend. I would love to hear about it. Okay. Almost there. What's that? Panda Cub. That was kind of creepy. What's this? Falls pick. File from. Oh, here's the pick. Oh, that's the Panda Cub. Creep me out. I didn't even know you could get. Like. Oh man, seriously, I gotta wait wait for it to respawn now. Lame. Okay, now we got it, while well, these guys are fighting away. So we got the pick. Let's see, which way do we need to go? We'll go this way to get towards the uh, Burning Blade Medallion. I'm guessing this is the one where we actually have to kill something. Come on, show me the money. Alright. 
Try to see if those other guys are coming to follow. Because if they are, I can try to let them kill something. So maybe it'll even out and I can get to the boss before them. <laughs> uh, the fun of trying to uh, get to a kill first. Is this the guy? Nope. Wait, fell staker. Just trying to see what it is we're supposed to be taking out. Ah, it's right up there. All right. Looks like, how do we get up there? A nice walk. Come on, get, let me out. Uh, let me out. Okay, so maybe I could probably try to uh, get him from here. We shall hope. Yeah. Wait, no? Maybe... No, those other guys got him in first. Dang it. I went the wrong way. Dum dum me. Let's just run this way. Oh, nope, that's a dead end. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. Wrong way. Um, oops. Let's try to go this way. Shall we? No, get up. Okay, we made it out. Now we can go the long way back around and hopefully make this happen. <clears throat> yeah, so we gotta go up this direction. Here. Nothing like getting lost. Oh, man, we gotta go the really long way. Over here, and then this direction. There we go. Okay, we lost all those things, so anything else will definitely shoot now. Because we don't want to have other guys on us when we go after this boss guy. Luckily... I guess early enough that there's not too many people trying to go after the same little boss. So hopefully we can get there in time. And hopefully we're going the right way this time. Alright. Is this the right way, me hopes? Aw, oh, dang it, Bobby. Let's invite this person to a group. Oh, wait, no? Maybe they're already in a group. Um, invite me, please? Yay! <laughs> nice people. Well, that was easy. Make sure that we are the polite and say thank you. And there we are. All right, let's head out of here. Now I'm not even going to worry about these guys. We're just going to run past them all and get the hell out of here. Run for your life. Alright, just making sure we're going the right direction. Return you to Razor Hill. Oh, that probably popped up because usually you could use that to go back to the starting area to turn these guys in. But now it's Razor Hill, so we don't want to use that. That would put us in the wrong place. Not the right place. Okay. Yeah, because it wants us to use the Hearthstone to get back, but that's not what we want to do because changed it to Razor Hill from our boo-boo mistake. 
of walking over there too early. All right, we got 244 arrows. Plenty fine for now. Ooh, wow. We got a lot of stuff on us. Anything we can use, maybe, perhaps? Leather. Do we have a wrist? That's 12, so all those are 12 already, too. 17 for pants. 17 for pants. Cloth, 5. Ooh, okay. We can definitely put on the pants. Pants are helpful. Okay, let's go get rid of this stuff, because we're full. So, tr before we can turn in, we probably need to get rid of stuff. How can I help you? you can help me by... Let's see. Selling all of our trash. Like so. And then get rid of you as well. And we're good to go. Uh, that's 61, 61. Probably just sell some of this food junk that we don't need. Yeah, get rid of you. And we'll just keep the apples. For the horde. Yes, for the horde indeed. Okay, so this is the one we can turn in, and we got this guy here. Um, get rid of you. So choose your reward. Leather. Yeah, we'll go with leather, guys. Like so. How are we? Almost halfway to level 6. Very, very nice. And anything good from this guy? I guess not. Alright, we'll put that health potion on there for emergencies. And see about learning anything before we head back off to Razor Hill. Oh, we don't have anything to learn yet. Okay. Probably level 6 then, would be my guess. Let's just sell these raggedy leather pants that we've been wearing. They smell... They, they, yeah, they smell quite bad. May your blades never die. That doesn't make sense. A blade is an inanimate object. It can't die. Okay, not going to think about that too much. Let's go to Razor Hill. Mmm, quick travel. And? We've arrived, and we were looking at this guy's butt. Perfection. That was the innkeeper. Alright. Let's try and at least do maybe this quest. Ooh, what's that? Bob. Ah, that's that guy's qu uh, pet, which I believe you can get your first pet at level 10, you have the quest. Because usually level 10, you have your, uh, you have a class quest for the warrior, so you can get taunt and a couple other good skills, especially for tanking. <clears throat> trying to make sure we're going in the right direction. I guess it's over towards these uh, ruins that we're going. Try to avoid as much as possible, though. Well, I take a little drink. Alright, so here we go. Oh, wow, that guy has a speed boost run. Are you? Yeah, he's a human. Why are there humans way over here? Look like pirates. Pirate humans? Don't run away from me. Alright, so it looks like we have to slay some. Oh, it's all just different types that we have to slay. Okay, that's good. Nothing we have to worry about picking up. Level sevens, though. Just 
just means that we can't pull a bunch of them at the same time and try to make it happen. It's going to be nice though when we have a pet because we can just send our pet out to tank it while we shoot the guys. There you go. Alright, this guy's just level 6. Let's see. Might level up just from all the kills we gotta get from this one. Since it's a kill quest. Huh. I'm trying to see how we set waypoints. I'm not really sure. Hmm. Not even sure really which one's doing that. Thank you for uh, <coughs> putting a hit on my guy. Oh, there's one right here. Gotta be careful about that. Oh wow, there's actually quite a few that are going up that. There we go. So 68 per might be enough that we'll level up just from killing guys. Definitely seems like it for sure. If it, they're all going to stay 68 XP, because we're only 750 away. Oh, our health is low. Uh, uh. Okay, good. He's trying to run away. It's a good thing about some of these guys that run away at like a quarter HP is if you're having troubles, then you don't have to worry about them once you get them that far. Let's just eat some apple, though. First time actually having to take a break and eat something to get our, our HP zores back. One good thing about a lot of these starting zones is at least the uh, guys respawn fairly quickly. It's also kind of a bad thing sometimes. But, uh... Especially right now, it's a good thing because we don't have a ton of people to fight over it. So it just makes it easier to get through all the kills. This is going to be tough since we dragged in two guys. I can't wait till we get a CC. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We have a healing potion. Looks like we got another one of them sometime, somehow, too. Alright. And. Let's see. So, Sailor. Hello there, Sailor. Would you like to take an arrow? Oh, wow. It's like that guy I just fought's basically already respawned after fighting those two guys. I could basically stand here and just get everything. I think. It's a sailor. Most of these are sailors, though. Marines. Lieutenant Benedict. Ooh, where's Lieutenant Benedict? So we can maybe make our way that direction. Okay, so let's make our way this direction towards Lieutenant Benedict. Since we have a bad guy, we have to go after. He's probably in that building. That would be my guess. Probably at the far end, after fighting our way through stuff. It's usually how bosses are. Wow, seriously, I missed? There we go. Let's see if this guy wants to just do it with me. Uh, invite? Come on, accept the invite. There we go. Make it a little bit easier for us to get through all this now. All right. 
definitely fun to try to be courteous with people, especially if you're working on the same quest. Try to get things done faster. And then you aren't trying to steal as many kills from each other. This guy's not a hunter as well, so it's we have a little bit of a variety. Alright, I think I heal up a touch. Just a touch though. Lieutenant Benedict, he must be upstairs somewhere? Maybe. Yeah, there's usually a room upstairs. Up, oh, there's a bunch of other people up here. Uh, invite. Oh, no. Let's invite these guys. Invite. Ah, they're already in a group. We will try and see about getting it ourselves here. Yay, we got it first. Haha. -ha. Somebody was on the ball. And we're good to go. Woohoo! Let's see, we need one more sailor and five more marines. I think the marines are more inside and the sailors are more outside. So this will be our last sailor. Good, good, good. what about marines? Up, oh, there's a marine. That a marine? Nope, that's a sailor. Not too worried about him. I'm just gonna go ahead and leave party, so I don't have to worry about those guys any. Up oh, here's a marine. Nope, that guy already. If he put a mark on him, I'm not gonna worry about it. At least be courteous enough not to uh, shoot the guy after he's put a mark on it. Which we should be able to get our mark here really soon too. I think once we level... Because level 6... Come on. Take this guy out, please. Is that a marine? Yes. Okay, so this one and two more marines after that. And we're good to go. Oh, wow. Ooh. Ah, I used up all my healing potions. No. Oh, ha, yay, yeah. Woohoo. He's running away. Okay. Ooh. Close one. Let's have a seat. Oh, that guy's level 7. I wonder it was a pretty good shot on him. Oh, that's who we were just uh, with in the group. The Death Shotter. So, two more Marines, and then we're fine. Just kind of spamming tab to see if anything pops up. Oh gosh, that guy. I guess 
guess he bit off a little more than he could chew. Sailor, you're a Marine. All right, just this one last one, we can go back. Hopefully, it's a pretty good quest we got here to turn in. Yay, we've done it. Excuse me. Okay, let's head back. Back into the auto run. We just gotta go northward. Northward and onward. Oh, good times. So, thank you for joining me if you've just started to hop in. Uh, make sure to follow. I do streams usually on Friday mornings and should be doing World of Warcraft here for a while for them. Uh, also, you can check me out on YouTube. All the information is here on the Twitch page. Uh, you come on YouTube. I got over 500 videos there and I tend to post the streams uh, after as well. So if you missed anything and you want to check out everything that I did for the stream, you can uh, check it out on YouTube. So make sure to go there and subscribe and follow here so you keep up to date with all the good stuff. You can also uh, check me out on Twitter because I tend to post a lot of cool things there. And it uh, lets you know when I have new videos up and when I'm streaming so you don't miss anything. Alright, so almost there to the Razor Hill. I'm trying to figure out how I set my own waypoint with this thing. Paying one silver for guild charter signatures in front of the inn. Okay. Um, I'll probably end up creating a guild on this character just for, you know, everyone who wants to hang out. This is, like, basically going to be my stream character. For the Horde. Current quest. Okay. It's all new ones that I picked up. And... I don't know if there's... Ah, here we go. Wait, what? Cook. Okay. You're a cook. Do we have anything we can put on? This is a gun. We can't use a gun. Benedict key unique. Hmm, what's this key for? That's interesting. Very, very interesting. Sort of ish. Sub sug. Sub sug? Let's just get rid of these guns. Like a so. Yes, I will go with honor. Thank you. Alright. So, I think that's going to be it for today's stream. I will send you off for a raid or host, so make sure to stay tuned for that. I uh, hope you guys enjoy today's stream. Make sure, if you uh, want to watch anything you might have missed, to check it up on YouTube. I'll try to get it up here at some point this weekend. Uh, also, you can check out the last video I did during the, uh, the test phase for WoW Classic. Uh, that one's already up, as well as all the other videos and stuff like that. So hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Have a great weekend. And as always, don't forget to live long and prosper!